We begin in the South Bay, where the man a Chula Vista police called the tip jar bandit is finally in custody. They say he hit more than a dozen stores and restaurants in just the past month. And Fox 5's Jeff McAdam, he starts us off live from the South Bay with the takedown that landed him in cuffs. Jeff. Hi, Maria. Yeah, his luck finally ran out. Walked into the wrong restaurant, messed with the wrong manager. He took this tip jar right off the counter and then sprinted out the store, thought he had gotten away scot-free until he looked over his shoulder and saw the manager running after him. Surveillance video from inside Novo Brazil, a brewery in Chula Vista, was rolling Thursday when this man, 32-year-old Tori Dwayne Simpson, came in. Manager Leonardo Bauer said the same guy filled out an application last week. When I saw him coming in, I was like, oh, this guy's coming again. He really needs a job. Let's give him an opportunity. But when Leo walked away from the counter, the man took off with the tip jar at about 60 bucks inside, the waitress screaming for someone to stop him. So Leonardo did. You know, it's like Spider-Man. You just have that instinct, you know, and I, I like to act right away, you know. So even though I'm like 40 pounds overweight, I just have to run after this guy, you know. And wouldn't you know it, the Brazilian used his feet to trip him. Well, he came and messed with the Brazilians. He, they, he shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> that was a, a, a guest here, and he... He was clapping when I came back and he said, man, you're the man. The guy was 10 yards in front of you and you, you, you just got him in like five seconds. I said, man, I think that in that time you get like some extra power, you know, and you just go for it. Police say the same guy is responsible for stealing out of more than a dozen tip jars, some more than once, like this one at the Nestle Toll House shop across the street. Leo held him down long enough for police to show up and take him away on felony charges. So I told him, man, you, why you did that? I was going to give you a job. You're going to make 15 bucks. You try to steal 60. That's like one shift. You could make the same money every day. Now you're going to work for free. You're going to need to do, you're going to do community service and nobody going to pay for you to do. Yep, he's right about that. Yeah, Leo said it's tough enough for the waiters and waitresses to get the money right now in terms of tips. He wasn't going to let this guy run out the door with it. Uh, it is worth noting that police say petty theft has been down significantly over the last nine months, and that's because most people are uh, staying home. So less chance for criminal activity. From Chula Vista, Jeff McGowan, Fox 5 News. All right, Jeff, thank you for that.